Hello, welcome to another video. Today I'm going to be doing an edit like uh, Flea and Milliam. This is very easy to do, in my opinion. Just takes two apps and recording the cinematics. I just recorded a whole 10 minutes and it didn't record. This is my second time doing it. But, anyways. If you want to see any other tutorials just comment down below and be I'll be dropping the tutorial the big tutorial you guys all want at 3k 100 followers or um, 1k likes so make it happen okay this this uh, speed thing is just going to the part where it actually is okay I just want to show you the process okay so this is where it is you want to just change the camera angle just view it I, I was gonna use this thing but I, didn't, I wasn't happy with it anyways so just turn it around and then bam it doesn't matter how fast it is it's good, you can slow it down the one now you want, I'm going to do the first person thing it's pretty easy you just want to go to this view go into her face or his face and then just matter if it's blurring it's now just let go I'm happy with that. Now I want to go save it, and I already made a video on how to do that now. Video. Okay, now you want to go on video leap. Now you want to add the clip, which is this. Want to split it where you kill the person? If you have any questions, DM me on Discord, Twitter, on YouTube. It's not guaranteed I'll reply to you in the first coming minute, com uh, coming minutes. I mean, couple of days. But if you want a straight answer, as early as you want, uh, just DM me on Discord or Twitter or even Instagram. But if you have Twitter, DM me and I can answer more questions than about the apps that I used in my last video and all that you know okay now I just want to add your cinematic and then crop it uh, where you want to use the part that you want to use I want to use this I'm just going to crop it so if you hear background noise I'm using a fan it's very hot in England right now I also want to add the uh, first person and copy it. This part is actually very easy. It doesn't really take that much skill, time, this thing. I could definitely have made it better if I was using the app that I was uh, that um that I used my last one. But obviously, you have to give me to 3K and then I can have a lot of plans my next coming videos but if you have any ideas what you want just DM me I mean just uh, put it on the comments okay now I just wanna add your second one I mean add your music then a uh, mixer a link and then delete and then now I just wanna go to the beat drop Wait for a couple of seconds for it to load. Split it, go. Now this part is just fiddling to find which one looks the best, which part looks the best. I'm not going to talk with this part because this is just fiddling with it. I found it 
took a couple of minutes to find the best, which one looks the best. But yeah, it doesn't take that much t time. Can I just want to save it? Uh, max quality. Don't put 4K because it's a wasted because your bit clips are not going to be 4K unless you are actually going to 4K. Now, you want to open prequel prequel i'm not sure if it's on android i hope it is it's a bet it's a great app for effects could do a lot of them the only problem with it is you can't you can't split it and put it like in a section you have to use the whole you have to put in the whole thing which i find re really bad but it's still usage if you want to put the thing on the whole f one anyways um just open it then uh just Add your clip. Add the one the video you saved. And then over it, you just uh, want to make the cat a square, and uh, then all effects, and then you want to go to retro, and then you want to go to um, uh, dust, then you want to go to one. You check two if you like it. No, I don't really mu just don't much difference, but I'm going to choose one for this. And then filter zero, don't put filter, and then put opacity 100, and then that's it, save it. And then you, there's a lot of other effects that you can do, there's a lot of stuff that you can do, there's a lot of filters, effects, trends, all this stuff. Yeah. See, there's like retro glitch frames, fashion, music, reflection, and a lot of others. And I just want to export video, takes a couple of seconds. Obviously, if you don't want to use, uh, have the retro or other styles, you don't have to use it. I'm just going to use it for this. This isn't, this isn't about adding effects. This video is about how to use the cinematics and put it into a uh, clip. So, um, if you want to see effect, use effects, check my uh, old videos. Uh, find other ways and all this stuff. I've been for the Save the camera roll. Now you want to open photos to crop it. This is very simple. I think all of you, all of you guys should know this crop it, fit into, fit into a clip, and that's it. Thank you guys for watching. If you have any other ideas, comment loyal if you 
if you've seen this part and I hope you guys